a new look, a new pair of shoes, things that are important to most teenagers. And I have to look good every time I step out the house, even for school, even if I'm going to church, I have to look good. But for some court-involved youth, clothes can be a luxury. It is so hard out there, and like I say, I don't, I, I don't think we totally comprehend how hard some people have it. Now, kids and their families can come here. The Kids Closet at the Youth Services Center, a free clothing bank of donated goods, housed in what was once an old laundry room. Uh, it was a disaster area. There was just debris and uh, storage materials that had just been tossed in there, so it really was a dead space that wasn't doing a whole heck of a lot. But with the help of volunteers and a whole lot of donated goods, the closet opened its doors and its arms to the community. Many of the kids themselves help keep it stocked and looking good. And in turn, these new threads are breaking down some old barriers. And miraculously, the, the kids will begin to open up to their probation counselors and begin to share their stories and begin to trust. And again, I think it's connected to their feeling cared for. They are feeling cared for by their counselors, by the system as a whole. It's, it, the whole project, it just brings transformation and healing. It's still clothes that can, you can wear on your body and keep you warm and keep you going about your day. So I think it's really nice that they put this together. All these people are feeling deeply cared for uh, because this resource exists. To find out more about Kids Closet or to donate, you can call 206-205-9621 or send an email to kidcloset at kingcounty.gov.